There is a saying, perfection is the enemy of done. And it's real. It's not just a phrase. I see this all the time. So do others. Even Forbes has noticed. And they're kind of a big deal, don't you think? A lot of virtual assistants joining my virtual expert training program are self-proclaimed perfectionists. They want to produce high quality outputs for their clients. And that's not a bad thing, right? They also want the decisions they make and the virtual assistant and virtual expert businesses they create to be of the highest caliber. They don't want to spare or skimp on the details. And because they are thoughtful and intentional, they don't want to have unanswered questions. These are all amazing elements of the perfectionist personality. On the other side of that high quality, attention to detail, must have all the answers thinking, is the perfectionist who doesn't really get anything done or who sets their expectations so high, they always feel they've fallen short. Some people will say that this idea, perfection is the opposite of done, is just an excuse, a reframe for people to do shoddy work, to produce inferior products or services. That's not what I see in real time. Not at all, not even a little. I see incredibly gifted, talented, skilled people who struggle to share their gifts and talents and skills with the world because they're more attached to the idea of perfectionism than progress. If you make no progress, you are at a standstill. That will be detrimental to you and your business. One of the most significant drains on your productivity is worrying about being perfect. Nobody is perfect. We all make mistakes. Would you like to be a VA or a VE? and learn how to let go of perfectionism? If you're working on a project, give yourself enough time to go back and fix errors. Think things through, make adjustments as needed. Set small goals, develop a plan that makes room for still paying attention to all the details. Don't get stuck on the hamster wheel of perfectionism, going around and around and not really getting you anywhere. Progress, not perfection. Done, not unfinished. Deadline met, not missed. Think about it. Do you fall into the perfectionism trap? What's it costing you? I'd love to hear your thoughts and comments below. If you're ready to find out if becoming a virtual assistant is right for you, sign up for my five-day training. Create your new career in the new economy by clicking the link below. Also, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Click like on this video. I'd really appreciate it.